Good morning. Today we'll be doing the Liturgy of the Hours morning prayer for January 1st, Monday. Today we celebrate the Solemnity of Mary, Mother of God. Let's have that moment of silence to prepare us for our prayer. God, come to my assistance. Lord, we are pleased to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hallelujah. <laughs> The Virgin has given birth to the Savior. A flower has sprung from Jesse's stock, and a star has risen from Jacob. O God, we praise you. O God, you are my God. For you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you, like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary, to see, see your strength, strength and your glory. For your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name, I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. Oh, my bed, I remember you. On you, I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Virgin has given birth to the Savior. A flower has sprung from Jesse's stock. And a star has risen from Jacob. O oh God, we praise you. Mary has given birth to our Savior. John the Baptist saw him and cried out, This is the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Alleluia. Bless the Lord, all your works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, Bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. 
mountain and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You spring, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creators, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men and humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt Him above all forever. Blessed are you, Lord, in the firmament of heaven. Praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. Mary has given birth to our Savior, John the Baptist, saw him and cried out, This is the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Alleluia. Mary has given birth to a king whose name is everlasting. Hers the joy of motherhood, hers the virgin's glory. Never was the like seen before, never shall it be seen again. Alleluia. Sing a new song to the Lord, his praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let Zion son exult in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. Shout for joy and take the rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hands. To deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings and chains and their nobles in feathers of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained. His honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Mary has given birth to a king whose name is everlasting. Hers is the joy of motherhood. Hers is the joy of glory. Never was the like seen before. Never shall it be seen again. Alleluia. A reading from the book of the prophet Micah. The ruler in Israel will give them up until the time when he who is to give birth has born, and the rest of his brethren shall return to the children of Israel. He shall stand firm and shepherd his flock by the strength of the Lord. In the majestic name of the Lord, is God. He shall be peace. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Peace. Shalom. Pax. I remember this line, Pax et bonum, meaning peace and all good. It's a phrase that was loved by St. Francis of Assisi. And this is just a most fitting greeting if we want to greet our neighbor a happy new year. We say, Pax et bonum. Everyone has worked so hard the past year to attain peace and maybe for security. The busyness of, the, of our life makes us always forget their objective is to attain peace as compared to earning riches. 
peace is a gift that if we attain will give us contentment. The peace, true peace, is available to everyone amidst the chaos and challenges of life. A gift we receive from the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ, born of the Virgin Mary. See, Jesus gives us the gift of the Holy Spirit where we can find joy in our hearts. As compared to pleasure where joy lasts forever and gives us peace, pleasure is temporary. Jesus has claimed victory for the forgiveness of our sins, qualifying us for everlasting life. Jesus can shepherd us to that place of peace. Today, the Liturgy of the Hours prayer group greet you, Pax et Bonum, meaning peace and goodness for this coming year. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. The Lord has made known. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord has made known. Alleluia, alleluia. His saving power. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord has made known. Alleluia, alleluia. Marvelous is the mystery proclaimed today. Man's nature is made new as God becomes man. He remains what he was and becomes what he was not. Yet each nature stays distinct and forever undivided. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was his oath to war to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadows of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Marvelous is the mystery proclaimed today. Man's nature is made new. As God becomes man, he remains what he was and becomes what he was not. Yet each nature stays the same and forever undivided. Let us give glory to Christ, who was born of the Virgin Mary by the power of the Holy Spirit. And let us pray to him in these words, Son of the Virgin Mary. Have mercy on us. Christ, born of the Virgin Mary, you are wonder, counselor, and prince of peace. Keep, Keep your peace to the world. world. Our King and our God, you have raised up us by your coming. Help, Help us to honor you all the days of our lives, 
by our faith and our deeds. You made yourself like us. In your mercy grant that we may become more like you. You made yourself a citizen of our earthly city. Grant that we may become citizens of our true homeland, your kingdom in heaven. Let us pause for a moment to list up our prayers and petitions to our Lord Jesus Christ. Dear Lord Jesus, we lift up to you our prayers and our petitions together with the prayers and petitions of each and everyone who are praying with us this morning. We ask, dear Jesus, that you hear and answer each and every prayer as we pray. Son of, of the Virgin, Virgin Mary, Mary have, have mercy, mercy on us. us. Lord, remember us when you come into your kingdom and teach us how to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us pray. God our Father, may we always profit by the prayers of the Virgin Mother Mary, for you bring us life and salvation through Jesus Christ, her Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May the Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God. Thank you for praying with us. We hope you can join us again tomorrow. Same time, same place, same channel. Have a great day.